These are three secrets you didn't know about in Batman Arkham's DLCs. Let's go. The first is if you go into the Elliot Memorial Hospital in Arkham Knight during Rachel Ghoul's DLC, you can find the bodies of the waitress and the man you talked to at the beginning of the game that are killed in the diner along with Talia's body being missing as she dies in Arkham City. The next is an Arkham Origins DLC called Cold Heart, in which you can find the freeze grenades that Mr. Freeze gives you in Arkham City within his weapons testing lab. This shows that he's been working on this weapon for quite a while because Arkham City doesn't actually take place until way later in the game's timeline. And finally, in Harley Quinn's Revenge in Arkham City, when you enter the office at the Sarana Steel Mill, you can find Scarface the ventriloquist dummy sitting in a crib dressed up like the Joker with several pregnancy tests scattered around the floor. It's such a shame that we never actually get to see the character in action because it would have been really cool to see what we would have gotten in an Arkham game with the ventriloquist. But that's why 